How are you doing, Heather? Oh. Sorry. Oh, you're doing farming. I I put crops out. Do you want to come to sleep? They're gonna grow like crap, just so you know. Until we build a greenhouse, but we can work on a greenhouse for you. Glass work. Thanks for that. Oh. Why are they gonna grow so bad? Just they're gonna be incredibly slow. Okay. I mean, I just planted whatever I could find, really. That, that's okay, like, learning the aspects of the game. There's actually a mission where you have to farm a whole crap load of stuff. Huh. To the point where I actually had, um, 48 farm plots growing the food I needed it to grow. Yeah. Uh, underneath greenhouses and stuff, like... That's the same mission that I had to collect, like... What was it? My complete inventory full of stacks of cooked meat. Wow. Your supplies... Like, there's supply missions for the stations, right? So you come down, you've got to supply food, and other ones you're supplying resources. Anyways, you asked how I'm doing. I am short 20 concrete to be able to make the furnace and then I need to go and get uh oh concrete so you need silica ore right silica and stone yeah I'm working on silicate right now I found two nodes and I was like that makes glass right well that not also yet. makes glass too so but yeah, yeah not yet so we need 20 32 32 We're looking the order of four or five hundred silicate just to do the stuff before we get to class work. Yeah. I mean, that's not completely true. I mean, we could go straight to glass works rather than trying to get the fabricator first, but I mean, you decide how we're gonna do it. Do you wanna get this farming thing like that? Ah, no. Let's not worry about the farming thing. <clears throat> No, I think we should worry about the car. Okay. New aspect of the game for you to check out. Yeah, well, I was considering <laughs> if I, with my last talent points, take the screen farming super green faster one for grown food doesn't decay. And then I go down hunting Wait, you found you. the one where it doesn't decay? Oh shoot, I'm not gonna be able to get that actually because it takes too many points in there. Yeah. Anyway, I'm... I'm just kind of checking things out, you know? It moved its location in the list, that's why I couldn't find it. Yeah. But yeah, I found it. I mean, realistically, uh, it says you played 33 hours recently to get to level 40. So it wouldn't be that bad to, uh, to start over and try another character with different stacks. The one thing is, the exotic unlocks are account wide, so now that you've done that one mission, you'll always be able to find exotic uh. nodes. And once we're done this mission, you always have a chance of finding exotic deposits if they're on the map. Yeah. Uh. Uh. I don't know how I feel about starting a new character though, like, just so much work doing the missions. Yeah, but you don't have to start at mission one. Your new character will have all these missions marked as check marks since it's a count. Really? Yeah, so you can oh, start a new awesome. character that's level zero, but go to the next mission in line. And then your gear, is that account wide too? <laughs> it's what account wide? Your your gear, like how I bring down an oxygen tank. Oh, yeah. stuff you bought at the store? Yeah. You would have to take it out of the loadout and put it in the general inventory for your person to pick, 
or you could use the money that you have saved up to buy another one so that you have one for each person. Huh. That's very good. I didn't think it did, did it that way. So yeah, I, I might just like start a new character then. I don't know what I would take differently though. Well, I mean, if you want to start a new character to play around with a certain aspect, what we can do is get this mission done so that you have a character that, if you ever choose to play on your own, can get the radar and stuff and do that, right? Yeah. Which we could, after this mission, so next mission, you could just start a new character and say, okay, well, this character, I'm going to go down the talents of the farming and get that so food doesn't spoil and make me have to produce a farm for you every time. Which, I mean, I don't care about. Like, it's easy enough to do. I mean, all we have to do is make the glasswork bench, which we need some iron, some wood, epoxy, rope, and copper nails. Oh, shoot, I broke my iron pick. That's okay, we still have some iron to repair <laughs> stuff with. We, we do need to cave dive before we do too much more. Yeah. But I would well. like to, um, maybe get a steel pick before we can go to the next cave. But for that, like I said, I need... 20 concrete, so you should have enough silicate to do that. Yes, I just went out and got like 300 silicate or something. Oh, that should be more than enough. It does take a lot of silicate to build greenhouse stuff, okay? Okay. Like silicate, iron, and I think epoxy to make the greenhouses. And they're very susceptible to weather. Oh, wait, so we're going to have to repair it during storms? Yes. Unless my trick still works. What trick? It makes it look kind of ugly, but we cover it. Doesn't that defeat the purpose of a greenhouse? <laughs> you would think it did. Uh, I'll show you, because this design of base actually has um, um, a greenhouse portion that I have not been building. Just because I've not seen the point to going that far. But you'll see that this has a greenhouse. See, what's the uh, stuff you grow even used for? Cooking foods. Depending on what, uh, like, I don't know what you threw in there. You threw yeast? And yeast yeast in both of these okay these will yeast is something that does grow but wheat is pointless to grow you get so little back that you would need a massive farm to make it effective because you bench. <laughs> you use a massive amount of yeast yes think you know what i mean like you went out and harvested all that yeast it would yep. take probably 20 farm plots with several growth cycles to get that much yeast Yikes. Okay, and you do have to keep it on. Yeast, you don't have to worry about, okay? Because it doesn't spoil. But if you're growing, like, watermelons or something, once it grows the watermelons, it starts spoiling right away. Oh, so that... you got to stay on top of that. Um, an ice box would be really nice, but we'll not worry too much about that. Why is there sulfur? In... Oh, I That's guess you're doing... Fault. I... I just got it, sorry. You see, right back here, I need to fill this corner with something. I, I always uh, put a door right here. Well, this might be a problem. And then I would build foundations out here that the uh, grow plants and greenhouse get built on. Yeah, you know, I think, yeah, especially with it right on the like, it's gonna look pretty with the greenhouse out back. Until we do something to protect it with the storm. <laughs> yeah. It's gonna look butt ugly then. How come, I don't understand why the glassware would, cause like, glass in real life, realistically, can take some of that, you know? If you build it right. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, well, since that's a project that we're working on for you, I need 
five more foundations built. Okay. So I'll work towards getting the glasswork bench and stuff. If you can get the five foundations built just out the back there. Yeah. Like there needs to be mm -hmm. one to step out onto and then four going towards the chimney. So it's like basically behind this wall here is where it's going to be. Can you make an ice box or no? Uh, I don't know. Okay, well, if you're going to get into growing, I very much suggest that you get into an ice box. Got nails. You're not turning all of our copper into nails, or all our iron into nails, are you? Nope, just, I uh, just needed 60. Okay, I need 8 iron to make the ice box. How many more platforms do we need? Eight just more. five? Yeah, just make five and then find. you might have to make some extras. Why did I make five when I needed eight? <laughs> okay. Grab some wood. Okay. The ice box. have an ice box, we just need some ice to help keep it fresh. Oh, I went out to mine stone and my pick is broken. Great. We <laughs> have one iron ore. <laughs> can I so turn it into... You can okay. use it to repair your pickaxe, but that means that we're hitting the cave rather than trying for steel tools. Yeah. Uh, I guess you take the... Uh, Gold and copper pickaxe. Sure. So again, you take that one, and I'll go and collect it as much iron as I can. Yeah. So do you want a small garden to, um... Just a small garden to play around with. Practice, practice with? Okay, yeah. you're gonna be able to get, um... I think about six grow plots into the four spots that we're making for it. <laughs> oh, twelve, actually. Either eight or twelve. Because you put them two beside each other. Yeah, you should be able to get twelve. This top part here at the back has a copper node at the top. I never grabbed my uh, ramp you made me. Well, I've got mine with me if you need it. Okay.
that we really need it. Well, I mean, we could use cold burn instead, but if we start really getting <laughs> more blood. So making different characters can have different skill sets to help you out when building your outpost if you decide to build that. Or if you decide to help someone else build theirs, you know. Hmm. You can bring like different characters to your one outpost? Yeah. Although I have to, like, leave, if I take one of my character there, I have to leave with my character before I bring another character. Yeah. <laughs> you have your pick, right? You may as well collect the coal then. Yeah, probably. Uh -huh. Yep. <laughs> it's so hard to see. You have more iron in this cave. Is it just these two nodes left? Of iron? Uh, I think so. Oh, wait, there's another node here. And here. Do you want me to help with that one? So you found two more nodes down here. Yeah, of iron. And another one here, and here. I've got almost a row and a half of iron on me. Yep, so you passed one, and there's one on the other side. <laughs> and then over here, there's two. Okay, <laughs> yeah, why don't you drop that one here?
the last one? Mm, I mean, there's one right here that I'm standing on, but that's yeah, it, that's I think. the one I mean. I felt like this cave had less in it than usual. <coughs> yeah. <gasps> Did they do an emergency patch because they gave people too many, like, ores and stuff? <laughs> Not that I saw. Huh. I mean, you would have seen it do a download. So. Titanium. Bunch of titanium. Maybe getting too hunky rifles won't be too hard this time. Because we are going to the Arctic. Uh, okay, I'll let you know that much. No, I don't want to go to the Arctic. You want to abandon the mission? No, not really. I'm pretty tired today. I had to get up early, go to the interview. Couldn't really sleep last night. Well, I mean, we don't have to play. Like, we can call it a day for this. Yeah, but like, what else am I gonna do, you know? Sleep, rest? Yeah. Maybe, but I am D&D later, you know? We got another, like, 50 gold. Yeah, I'd say we're good for coal for a bit. Okay. I should take some of this and make some steel. Okay, so how are those five foundations for the back here? Oh, uh, I stopped to go mining with you. So, uh, I have no idea. I guess it's only four foundations. Let's see. Then you hit the chimney. So, we just need four? Oh yeah, I needed to mine stone, but my pickaxe was broken, and then we went to mine iron because I used the last iron repairing my pickaxe. So I need to go find some stone. Did you eat? There was stone in the cement mixer. Oh, okay. I mean, not a lot, but there's still some in there. It might be enough. Eh, uh, there's none in there. I just moved it. Oh. Got 186 stone in the masonry bench now. Okay, we can make our... Do we want four actually instead of five? Uh, one, two, three, and then we'll behind the door is four. Yeah, four. Okay. <gasps> I'm putting your pickaxe back in the anvil. Yeah. <laughs> 
it's a good thing we're getting some uh, iron.
stamina. They bit me, so I had to poison. So, can you actually hide in a rock during a storm? Yep. So, would this here work, what I've done? Uh, let me just finish up what I'm doing right now. I think I found the fish that was hurting you. Now, to know for sure, we'd have to wait for a storm. Right? Because that's the only thing they'll tell you if you shelter from the storm when the fire's there, right? How does but it look? Cozy? I, I would say yes, this should work. But to know for sure, we'll have to look, wait for a storm. Hmm. So you may have cut too much out of the sides, like here and over here. Yeah, I mean, I'm gonna mine anyway, I just thought, hmm, that looks cool. Yeah, it yeah. looks cool, it looks good, I think, for the most part, what you want to do is just make an entrance and then sort of tunnel through the inside of it out without doing that. <laughs> <laughs> without doing that and one percenting it. <laughs> yeah the downside of having that 1% skill. Yep. Okay, so we have the element. And that. We need six ropes. Six epoxy. Ten wood. What's that? Uh, I may have landed a tree on the house. So if it was a stone house, would it or a wood house, would the tree landing on it have caved it in? Possibly. I don't have a repair hammer, so I can't check for damages right now. Okay, we have the glass work, so. It does look slightly damaged. Probably not a bad thing that we're making a repair hammer. You're making one? Because I'm not making one, I just said I don't have one. I'm gonna try and make one, I just... Holy cow, we got a lot of fiber. Yeah, that was me just now. I saw we were running low, so I went out and hit things. Right. Okay. Okay. Oh. What is this? What is what? This roof. That's so you don't go running off into the lake when you come oh. out this door. <laughs> don't worry, it's still plenty enough room. And we're gonna build the greenhouse right here. 
I'm guessing you have no idea what design of greenhouse we're going for. Yeah, I don't really know. Um... We're just going to have it all be a lean-to greenhouse. So these last three squares here, you can get four crop plots on each one. Okay. And it's going to be a sort of, you go out here and you're crouching along to do your harvesting and stuff. It's the only way to get it covered and protected. you hate when you kill something you can't figure out where its body is you know there's there's a dead wolf out here but I can't find it my arrows in it okay, where are you at I'm to the south of the house. Up in the trees, picking up the work. Oh, I found it, okay. Have you checked on your uh, grow plots? Nope. How are they looking? They're still growing. So how did we figure out the atmosphere is to toxic? Um, either sensors or the old fashioned way. I'm not sure which way they chose to figure that out. Was it always toxic? Like I know it was toxic before they terraformed it, but was there a portion of time where it wasn't toxic while being the, terraformed? It, the terraforming screwed up right away, so I would think no. Uh, because there's exotic enzymes tree? in the the exotics messed with the enzymes that were being used to terraform it, right? So why would they wait like a month or a day or a year before they started messing with it, you know? Yeah. Huh. You no, know, I've yet to see a pig. They generally aren't this in this area most of the forested area they're not there it's just when you get close to the arctic areas that the pigs start to show up For you, I've been collecting some wood. Oh, we've got lots of wood. I was just gathering materials. Nice. And that's all our steel used up. Not nice. But we have two axes and two pickaxes. Nice. Just need to make another steel knife. We need 12 epoxy, 20 glass, and 8 iron for each one of these roof pieces. Huh. 
20 epoxy. How much of everything else? 20 epoxy. Um. Sorry, no. 20 glass, 12 epoxy, and 6 iron. Ah, 12 epoxy, 6 iron, yikes. Got, we need 18 iron. We've got that. Oh yeah, I guess we're not making that many. Okay. Well. Smelt up the gold before it does the glass. Let's put that out. You're working on some epoxy? Yep. I'm I'm making a hundred tree sap. And then we're gonna make that into epoxy. Don't forget to upgrade your tools. Oh, yep. Here is my mostly dead axe. My mostly dead pickaxe. I think it's time to sleep. We need more uh, sulfur. Probably for pistols or bullets, not pistols. Sorry, what were you asking? We need more salt. 
sulfur because that's what I'm currently running around looking for, like sulfur Probably and... Probably will, um... And oxide. Yeah, we're gonna need more sulfur. Okay. Five epoxy short boat. Darn. So. Yeah. Something else may want to. Sorry, dogs.
Well, you need the sulfur to make the growth pads anyways, because you need to make 12 of them. Okay. So, since it's not storming, I made the, uh, greenhouse. The way you would like it to be made, sort of. Like, there's a little bit that's in preparation, but... I don't know where you're at. Hello? Sorry, I was muted because dogs were barking. Um, I'm on my way back. Yeah. So, I mean, you can... I've got it sort of set up so you can see, like, this is how I would like it to look. Except for the walls, ignore the walls. But, uh... Yeah, the glass gets damaged by storms, so we've got to do something to... To protect it. Protect it with wood? Yeah, wood, which breaks down in storms as well. <laughs> Only difference is then. Oh, oh. Okay, take, take it down, take it down. Are you almost back? Yeah, uh, no, not really, because I'm encumbered. Uh, I'm running as fast as I can, but. Okay, the protection is down. The protection is down? Yeah, I've got it protected. <laughs> okay. Like having to do that, but it works for some reason. Because, yeah, greenhouses are made of glass that is meant to stand up to weather, so why doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. Yep. Like, I, I understand wooden structures degrading, but not glass ones, especially a greenhouse. Hey, a rain barrel will finally get some water in it. Wait a minute. I thought I heard the grass or glass creak. Nope, nope, they're all at 500 still. You've got a uh, repair hammer? Yeah, and 500, not 5,000. Yes, 500, I know. Not very strong. Not a lot of room to get past people here. <laughs> but the uh, growth rate still increases with this setup. Okay. I mean, you think it wouldn't, but it would. Like, you saw the stone ceilings above it, right? Yeah, I, I did. should keep these ones out here, like they're done growing now, but that way you can plant something in those ones and then plant one in the greenhouse, just to see the difference in time it takes to grow. Yeah. You yeah, know, just so you can see how much benefit it is. Twelve plots can fit in that space. Okay. I just have to line them up really close together and stuff. 
know, ba basically the same way I designed my entire house, right? Yep. The, the, there's an inch there that means everything on that side can move over an inch, right? that cave out or do you want to empty the water cave out or do you want me to do both of them? Um, I don't really know. Because we also need to go and hit the two caves in M10 to get the iron from there because we are out of iron. I want to place this plant. No, you, you do that. What should I do? Like coffee or something? Something that doesn't expire for a start. Um, like, to, to make anything with coffee? Let's see. To make tea, coffee, cocoa, goose tea requires 50 coffee plants. So if you plant one with each of those, uh, don't start in that corner. Start in the corner that you're standing in, because the metal, like this wall, won't move, right? Pick up the glass with Y, and then, and then place it, and then place the glass back down. It's just been a while since I've done it, so I forgot what order I have to do it in. Right? Uh, it still says it's colliding. I think. Oh, okay. It was Lining glass. that up square with this one is colliding with this piece of wood here. So that one's not quite square what's going on. Or maybe it is. It's a little I think you you can adjust it. Hey! Hey! <laughs> hey! Help! <laughs> I'm stuck outside now. Now you'll want to pick that up to put the next one on. May as well leave that roof there, because that roof... I tried to get a triangle piece that would fit in that spot there, but the stone one doesn't let you. Yep. Wish there was a way to make those snap to each other. Yep. <laughs> 